Hey, good afternoon, YouTube. We're going to do a uh, HTP lunchtime chat. We haven't done one in a while. Uh, a lot of topics going on out there, so I thought I'd hit on a couple of the high notes and uh, what's going on or my th some thoughts. But uh, we got some thunderstorms brewing up this afternoon. Hopefully we get more rain than lightning. That's for sure. But, um... You know what's going on I guess the biggest thing you see out here on YouTube uh, you know countrywide I guess would be the Jade Helm issue subject exercise whatever you want to call the situation um, got a lot of people concerned um, a lot of people wondering what's uh, going to happen wondering what it all means is it going to escalate to something else is it a soft drill just to uh, acclimatize people, etc., etc.? And uh, I don't know. Does I don't know that it really matters what it is. The big question is: that Are you prepared for it? Um, and I think uh, most of the responses, are people's reactions on YouTube, means that we are not uh, ready for it because there's an awful lot of fear and uncertainty out there, and uh, unpreparedness causes that. Um, I'm not going to say I'm completely prepared because I know I'm not, but, um, you got to take what you don't, what you know, you don't know and have, put some action before it. I think the biggest problem we have is our networks aren't big enough. Our communication network isn't expansive enough and quick enough to respond. And that causes a lot of anxiety and we all know it. We all know that we can't get the word out soon enough if things do go south, if things do go live if uh, an incident does occur. Um, even with all the worldwide social networking and everything else, um, I think we know that if this thing actually kicked off with all the internet control switches and everything else that's out there, they can very easily uh, shut down local networks and things to minimize information flow out of those areas. And those in, the, in what we now, you know, now the internet and Twitter and everything is a is a traditional mode of communication and I think we all know that we're not prepared to have to deal with that um, and that that's it's caused a lot of problems so I think the biggest thing is uh, improve your network improve your communication abilities improve the size of your group and your planning um, you know no comm plans if you got no comm what do you do um, type things and that's at least taking action to improve upon what we got, you know. If you don't currently have the capability, get an HF trans uh, receiver and at least be able to listen in on uh, HF transmissions that somebody might be putting out or be able to put out your own should something go down. I think that would solve a lot of the anxiety around Jade Helm and tell them to bring it. <laughs> uh, but anyway, the Oregon BLM situation. Uh, Obviously, people should be concerned or at least uh, interested and uh, stay informed on that. The BLM basically came in without any uh, legal justification or backing and issued a cease and desist to a gentleman who's on ex extensively his own property based upon mining law from when that uh, deed was established. If you haven't seen the videos Blaine Cooper's been doing on that, they're really good. Hosh USMC is up there. Uh, they still want people to come up and participate, but remember it is a locally led operation. You fall under their rules, as it should always be. Um, the local militia, the local group controls the situation. It's their area. If you don't want to abide by their decisions, I would say leave. I mean, that's just the way it is. But by all means, go support. They can use lots of other logistical support, I'm sure. Um, anything you can offer. They're talking, you know, fuel cards and everything else. So, worthy cause. Uh, to BLM's unjustified actions. Another thing that just came up, I saw a video this morning, which I can't remember the gentleman's name. I guess he was out of Texas. He, I got it forwarded through somebody else. Um, went to a gun range in Texas, and they told him he couldn't shoot his AR pistol because the ATF issued a letter of some sorts saying that uh, it is a uh, not allowed or that if you 
I guess they said if you shoot an AR pistol, you have to be on a pistol range. Um, or if you have a SIG brace, I guess you have to go to a pistol range. I'm not sure the language, but it was baffling. I'll try to find it, put it in the comment link below. But that just goes with more of uh, the BLM's unconstitutional actions. I mean, if you're a private purveyor at a shooting range, why does the ATF even have your address? I mean, I guess if you have a, a gun range, some gun ranges sell guns, so I guess that one might be the case. But I hadn't heard anything about this. Uh, some ATF letter about restricting where you could fire your firearm. And, uh, I mean, when, when's somebody going to tell them to pack sand? I mean, I guess people, there are people are there's people out there telling them to pack sand because I know they're out there shooting with their SIG brace on. But, uh, I don't know. Somebody that's uh, got a little more skin in the game needs to tell them to pack sand, for lack of a better word. Or there's a lot better words, but I just won't say them on here. So that's kind of three current highlights I've noticed. Um, things continue to march on. Uh, the economy is still in flux. China just had a big a dump of stimulus they did that shot their stock market up. And then the stock market is hit on Friday. It's all chaos. It's all uncertainty to cause you know people to uh, question what's going on. Whatever. Uh, if you got it in the bank, get it out. That's the best advice I can get you. Um, Greece is talking about uh, pulling out of the euro, and they're already talking about. Public, uh, all public assets are being pulled out of uh, out of public hands. Basically, anything that the government owns is getting put into the banks, which is craziness. All right, YouTube, that's kind of the update here. Hope everybody's doing good. Stay in contact. Get those networks going. Live free.